हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल तो आज हम क्लास सेवेंथ लेसन नंबर फोर न्यूट्रिशन इन लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम्स की एक्सरसाइज पढ़ने जा रहे हैं थर्ड क्वेश्चन आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चंस इन योर ओन आंसर्स ए व्हाई डू लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम्स नीड न्यूट्रिशन आंसर वन टू सप्लाई द एनर्जी रिक्वायर्ड फॉर डूइंग वर्क सेकेंड फॉर द ग्रोथ एंड डेवलपमेंट ऑफ द बॉडी बी Explain the process of production of food in plants. Answer: First, green plants can produce their own food with the help of sunlight and chlorophyll. Plants make their own food in their leaves using water and nutrition from the soil and carbon dioxide from the air. Second, this process is called as photosynthesis. This is the reaction of the following process. C What is mean by parasitic plants? Name their different types with example of each. Answer: The plants that grow on the body of other plants to obtain food are called as parasitic plants. There are two types of parasitic plants. First, holoparasitic example Rafflesia. Second, hemiparasitic example Laurethesia. D. Explain the various steps of nutrition in animals. Answer: first injection food is taken into the body second digestion conversion of food into simple soluble forms third absorption transfer of soluble food food to the blood fourth assimilation utilization of absorbed by food by cells and tissues for energy production growth and repair fifth ingestion removal of waste product from the body E name some unicellular organisms in which all the life processes takes place within their unicellular body answer unicellular organisms like amoeba euglena paramecium in which all life processes take place within their unicellular body fourth give reason a insectivorous plants are attractively colored answer number 1 insectivorous plants generally grow in soils or water deficient in nitrogen compounds second droplets of sticky substance found on tips of hair attract insects third to attract the insect these plants are attractively colored b butterflies have long tube like proboscis answer holozoic mode of nutrition means the feeding of soil and liquid food by animals to suck the nectar from flower they have a long tube like structure called proboscis sixth think and answer a we prepare a variety of food stuffs and dishes at home are we then autotrophic organisms answer number 1 We prepare a variety of food stuffs and dishes at home but we are not autotrophic organisms. Second point, in autotrophic organisms they have chlorophyll in their body and food is prepared with the help of sunlight. B. Which organisms are greater in number, autotrophs or heterotrophs? Why? Answer: 1. Autotrophs have chlorophyll in the cell and prepare food using sunlight and CO2 and water. second heterotrophs are depend on autotrophs for survival hence autotrophs are more in number than heterotrophs c the number of heterotrophs found in desert region is smaller however they are found in greater numbers in the sea why is this so answer number 1 In desert region due to scarcity of water and excess heat very few cactus are found as autotrophs compared to seas as autotrophs are less number of heterotrophs depend on autotrophs are smaller second whenever whereas in sea due to great numbers of autotrophs great number of heterotrophs are found D what damages or harm so ectoparasitics and endoparasitics animals cause Ec number 1 ectoparasitics animals suck the blood of the animals on a which it remains and 
endoparasitic animals get ready made food from the body of animals in which it remains second these way both parasitics makes the animals weak by sucking their blood or by acting prepared food for them e why is plant food not produce in any other part of the plant except the green ones answer plant food is not produce in any other part of the plant except the green ones because only green part contains chlorophyll and chlorophyll is very necessary for the production of the food thank you everyone agar aapko is lesson ki match the pair और भी कुछ टेबल्स कंप्लीट करने हैं तो नीचे दिए हुए डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए हुए लिंक पर जाके आप कंप्लीट कर सकते हैं थैंक यू एवरीवन